Hey everybody, Sniper the Lazy Man here. Welcome back to Let's Play Drakengard. Alright, so in the last episode, we are still on this map. I'm serious, we are still here. It's bothering me. So hopefully we can finish this up, finally. And, uh, get to what I want to do next. The worst part, the wor of course, the worst part about it is that if I want to get the weapon, which I should have been looking at my notes before, I before I started, uh, this level, but if I were smart enough and looked at them before, I could have had the weapon by now. But the worst part about it, I have to go through this level twice. Okay, I have to go through this level again. It's taking me, like, what, they start you, yeah, start you off always with an hour. I'm down to 22 minutes left. That's how long I've been on this one map. Now, majority of you guys have, now, parts of it you haven't seen, because I decided to just not show that. Because, um, it, it, you know, it's just a, just a big field of enemies, and I didn't really feel like... I, I guess talking over it, well, I, I shouldn't really say that. <laughs> you know, if, if something boring... Not exactly boring, but if, if something like that were just... Uh, you know, so, so, some, some big fight, you know, obviously it should be shown, but... But something like this, where you just kind of want to... Breeze through everything quickly, just kill a bunch of enemies... As, uh, as quickly and as much as possible. You know, you'd want to just... I just kind of get it over with. But, yeah. And, uh... Okay, so how many do we got there? Okay. Not too bad, a few more. Now, I... But yeah, that, that's, that's that's gonna suck. That I, I, I'll have to I literally actually breeze through this level on purpose. Uh, just so I can get the weapon... Just so I can uh, get the weapon and still can and still continue on with the let's play in the same video but it, it, it should, it should by then it shouldn't be too bad um yeah <laughs> I, I have no idea what, what i was actually going to go on and uh and say with that just it, sh it shouldn't be too bad just it'll take a little bit of a little bit of editing work and trying to figure out of uh and, and i guess more on me too to try kind of time out and figure out you know how much I need to keep. Alright, so yeah, we're almost done this. And, you know, hopefully, like, hopefully it definitely doesn't seem like I'm actually trying to sound like I'm bored of this game by any means. It's just, like, believe me, like, if anybody, if anybody has actually tried to play games and talk over, over them, it's actually quite hard. You know, majority of games, at least for me, when I when I play games, I don't tend to talk. I just I tend to just look at the screen, have my mouth open a little bit, just kind of drift off into into the world of of the game I'm playing, and I and I just I just sit here for you know hours hours on end. Oh, why why wouldn't that work? Whatever. You know, I I, I you know I sit here on hours on end. And uh, and just and, and just play games. Like, I don't try to talk over them. And wow, am I? Jeez, I'm almost dead here. Actually, there's a lot of uh, archers too, which that's not that's not fun. Ooh, there, get rid of them all. I'm sick and tired of seeing them. All right. Hopefully this should uh, end it up. But again, yeah, it, it's just it's actually it's legit it's legit really hard to talk about a game while playing it, especially if it's something I guess like this. You know, if it feels more of a uh, okay, okay, enemy leaders if they escape the enemy regroup, kill them before they flee. All right, good. Has the union won? That was easy. That was easy for you? Oh no, you're saying, was it too easy? Well... Shit, 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 oh! No! No, 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 no. Dryden, Dryden, please. Oh my god, oh my god. That's the second I, I, don't, I barely even have to jump on top of the Dryden, and they immediately just knocked me down. Oh, maybe I should have uh, waited. I thought there would have been a little bit of a uh, cooldown before I can use... The uh, oh, so many archers, so many archers. 
Okay, I'm on. I'm, I'm probably gonna need a little bit of a serious time right now. This is uh, this is getting a little bit hectic. The fact that I have such little health. Oh boy. Okay, as long as I can, if I can just get rid of the targets and the archer, some of the archers at the same time, that would be great. All right, get rid of this guy. Oh man, this is getting tough. Okay, as long as I don't. Almost there, almost there. The worst part, the worst thing is being uh, next to a wall. Oh, and we finally beat it. Oh my god. Yeah, that only took like 50 minutes. Ah, uh, 42, close enough. Jeez. How many levels up is that going to give me? <laughs> hey, nice 420 kills. Oh, barely. So, uh, almost three levels. Wow. The Dryden from 62 to 70 pa attack power. That is, that is great. And now I think there's three weapons I, I level up. Yeah, I think so. Okay, yeah, so Wisdom's uh, level 2 now. Mm, changes up a little bit. Uh, Fen's, Fen's Blave. And uh, Bone Breaker at level 4. So it gets a cool little uh, spike on the end of it. Uh, yeah. So good, I can forget about Bone Breaker basically forever. It's definitely not one I'm not going to use again. Um, I mean, unless I want to show off the, uh, what is that, like, again, unless, unless I do want to show off the, uh, what was it, the, um, the magic power, again, unless I want to show off that for every weapon at level 4, I doubt I really do. Alright, let's, let's, uh, let's switch out, um... Bone Breaker. Let's put on the Crimson Hood. Uh, there we go. Alright, good. So, um... Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's right. I was gonna, uh... Gonna have to redo that whole, uh... Level again. Um, alright, so, uh... I will see you guys back on this screen. Uh, when... Uh, when I get the, uh... The weapon and complete that level all over again. So, uh... So see, so see there, and uh, see back here in just uh, just a sec. Here we go. And uh, good, got that weapon now. All right, so that took uh, actually not too bad. But okay, so we obtained the weapon, holy mace, and mat with the magic attack, Gabriel's claw. And, uh, okay, so, so it's our first, uh, mace weapon. And, uh, well, you know what, I think I'll just, I'll, I'll leave it at that. So let's return back. And, uh, now we shall actually, uh, continue. The, uh, continue the game, actually. As a soldier sense victory, jubilation sweeps through the Union Army. Though his joy is tempered by concern of Furii, time, too, takes grin satisfaction to satisfaction in destruction in the destruction read just just read <laughs> satisfaction in the destruction of the hatred empire but above them a cataclysm gathers okay i don't think this isn't the one that has the other weapon i don't believe no no okay because this is yeah this is verse four okay
Okay, wow. So a lot of a lot of crap is, is going on right now. Massive fireballs from the Empire's floating fortress smash onto and once the once quiet battlefield. The Union's victory and its army are lost, and the land is turned to a hellish wasteland. A power inconceivable ha has been unleashed. It is an awful por portent that heralds the death of the goddess and the breaking of the seals. Kaim is gripped by remorseless rage. Alright, so, uh, this is actually the one that has the next weapon in it. Um, so what we got here? Chapter 5, verse 6. Talk to the soldier that is sitting down next to the line down soldier. Talk to him twice. Or, yeah, talk to him twice. Uh, he will give you the, the long sword. So, I'm guessing, now is it this guy? No, they are... No, it's not you. Okay. Lord How about you? I give you this sword. Okay, there we go. Avenge me. Yeah. <laughs> no problem, dude. I'll I'll definitely do that to avenge you. <laughs> not. All right. What's going on here, man? Ah, uh, uh, I do not understand. It cannot be. Has the last seal been broken? The blood of the goddess has been spilled. Uh, 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 it is the judgment of the gods. It is the judgment of the gods. The goddess dies and mankind is cursed. Uh. Only the gods know the truth. If we can find our way to them. Alright, so you obtained the weapon Nobuyoshi uh, and the match attack Susano's Veil. Okay, well, that's kind of interesting. Um, Alright, once again, I'll probably have to, I'll leave that for uh, for later. Until I, get, again, until I get another weapon to level 4, then I'll start adding in the level 1s. And again, I may need to actually practice with them. After the fi fireballs, after the fire falls from the sky, Imperial soldiers rise one by one from the dead, like demons of the underworld. What evil power remanates the Empire's army? That is a good question. So, is it true? Like, is Furiai has Furiai been been killed? Because it's the only reason why this could be happening. So, if I can lift the map. Okay, so destroy their remaining forces. Alright, let's uh, give that a go. Um, what should I use? I'll use Crimson Hood. So, I use Crimson Hood just for a little bit uh, during the mission there. So, you know, it looks pretty cool. But, I, I, used it, I used it for a little bit there, and for such a small axe... My... Oh, oh my god, is it slow. I didn't even realize how slow this thing was. Yeah, destroy the Empire's remaining forces. As long as none of them are red armored, I uh, I have no problem with that. You see, look at this. Like, look how ridiculously slow this very small axe is. But the magic attack is so cool. It surprisingly can't kill these guys in one hit. It leaves them with just barely a sliver of health. But the magic attack is, is pretty cool. Just like a couple of them that that shoot uh, uh, an attack. Basically, right on top of you. Come on. No, wh where are you guys going? Go come over here. Yeah, that, that is weird though. That I just it leaves them with barely a sliver of their health remaining. So I, I still have to swing it, but, but yeah, it, it's a very, very s slow weapon for what it being a very, uh, a very short uh, axe. But uh, you know, gotta you gotta adapt with each each weapon you obtain. It's not not gonna be a not gonna be the best uh, thing for all of them. Uh, 
Actually, we, uh, kind of a weird thing too is that, uh, is that of course, of course, I gotta love my, my capture, I gotta, I gotta love my HD PVR too, where it can't, where it's starting to cancel out, like start to just go to a black screen on, uh, my, on my laptop here, when it goes from a cutscene to back to just a normal game. So the whole nuclear explosion thing, really I had to cut it and then re, you know, I'm gonna have to fight. I, I, well, it's not gonna be hard, but I'm, I'm gonna have to um, cut it and then re and then edit it up so it's obviously looks seamless. But uh, basically, my, my laptop screen went went black right after the uh, the right after the screen went black the the cutscene there. So it's very it's very strange <laughs> why it keeps on doing that. I have a feeling it's just because it's on PS2 and because my uh, my TV like. Kind of like resets itself, or something like that, because like th there'll be like a slight flicker on uh, on my screen whenever it will go from cutscene to to back to in game, back to the in game, uh, um, you know whatever's happening. Okay, well you know what this probably uh, probably I, I should probably have enough for well I should probably have enough for an episode. Um, it just matters. It, it just all matters on uh, uh, if I can get everything to work work out work out fine. Should be no problem. But yeah, so uh, actually, once I get rid of these two, uh, actually, that's kind of a bad thing to do in the middle of a middle of a mission. Well, yeah, I, I was actually gonna say that. I, I was actually gonna say that I, I can just stop here and uh, pick up pick up where I left pick up where I left off. Hmm. Actually, you know what? That sounds like a good idea. Because I've done quite a few videos uh, uh, today, and uh, kind of lose. I'm kind of not really. Not, I, mean, I, I kind of don't know really what to go on or talk about, as I normally do when I do like five or more video, five five videos or so in a row. But okay, yeah. So um, I will leave it. Uh, leave it here for uh, next time. Um, I, as much as I don't like to do it, but I'll probably have to quit out and uh, and yeah. Okay, yeah. So uh, so thank you guys for watching. Uh, next episode we will uh, finish finish cleaning up uh, the empire, yeah, destroying the empire's forces, and uh, I'll hopefully find out uh, what's gone on, what's uh, what's uh, what's going on here. So uh, for Kaim and the Dryden, we are signing off.